Hi Scorpio, welcome, welcome back. You guys, listen, I don't have my mic with me, so please bear with me. Turn up your val volume, okay? Because <laughs> I don't have my mic, okay? So let's get started, you guys. I just wanted to see what the angels have for you today. Okay, this is going to be a daily spread. So let's get into Scorpio angels and you know, let me know what Scorpio got going on today, what their energy, what their person, is it the same, is it not? Because I do daily spreads on here, so thank you guys for all your love and support, Scorpio. I really, really appreciate it. You guys are amazing. All right, so let's get into it, y'all. Let's get into it for Scorpio, please. What's going on with their person? What's going on with their person? Thank you. Scorpio person. Okay. So we have the nine of wands here. That's your first card. So I'm feeling like, you know, you might be fed up with this person that's coming through here. Yeah. You're tying up the ten of cups here. You don't see this person as a long-term committed relationship anymore. Um, something that happened with this person where they put you through a lot of history here. They put you through a lot of pain here. Because I'm seeing that you're burned out. This person definitely you know, made you feel like they weren't really there, they wasn't present in this relationship, they didn't value this relationship, they didn't invest in you, um, they didn't really care about it. So you're looking at them as a loss in the start, in the reverse, like this is not your person, this is not who you've been waiting for, all right? So this person has been juggling two things that made this relationship go south. I'm seeing for some of y'all, yeah, 1111 is in the reverse, stating that you guys have a a disagreement or communication issues like you guys are not communicating with each other at this time all right so some of y'all might have a family together because the ten of pentacles is in the upright but however the ten of cups is in the reverse okay so the long term is gone the legacy is still is still there the things that y'all invested in, worked on together the things that y'all may come to life together which may be a family for some of y'all or it could be a business okay um but you are still trying to keep that open um you're trying to find out you know what you're going to need to do with this situation because this person is not mature enough to solve anything with you and is not mature enough to give you the commitment that you seek okay first of all they're very slow they're not moving very quickly towards you i'm getting aries leo or sag energy i'm also getting capricorn virgo or taurus energy okay the magician is here also where this is calling for prayer i'm seeing somebody manifesting or trying to you know protect their energy trying to breathe trying to control their breathing um trying to you know manifest this person back into their lives okay or hoping for the best i'm seeing a lot of forgiveness here letting go okay a lot of you know stressful moments like gone all right i'm also seeing like someone is waiting watching all right they're waiting to see what time or what's the perfect time to give you this choice, all right? This choice between, you know, something that they, like two things, okay? It's going to be a decision that you need to make going forward with this person. But I'm seeing that you don't really care about this. I'm seeing like this is like a dud to you. Like, okay, well, you did what you did and it's over and done with. I'm also seeing the Four of Swords, where you need to get away from this person for a minute. You need to recharge. You need to find yourself. You need to value your voice again. You need to, like, look within you and find out what you truly want for yourself, all right? So, and I don't see that you're ready to communicate with this person. I'm also seeing the Five of Cups in reverse here on the back of the deck with this person, okay, which is telling me that this person is going to regret this decision. This person is going to regret, you know, not investing in you. This person is going to live in regret, okay? I see that this person is thinking about you, but they're not making any movements, okay? I'm feeling like they're stuck into something because they cannot make the decision. It's like they know they're juggling two things that's unfair to you, and they need to make a decision about this, but they're not doing it, okay? They're just not. But they're going to give you some kind of, you know a wand the 11 card in your hands okay the sun is in the back um we also have the moon as well mixed in with it the unknown secrets i feel like this is an opportunity but again it's like you don't know what's gonna happen all right this could be good for you 
it, it's how you, you know, you take it. It could be good. It could be bad. Okay. But you know, the two of wands for me, it's opportunity. This person wants to give you the world. This person want to give you, you know, abundance, the two of wands, the four of wands follow, you know what I mean? So let's get some messages from the angel deck and see what's going on. Period. Let me move this over. Okay. Let's see. I hope you guys are doing very well today. I'm sorry I uploaded those videos late last night, but your girl was just all over the place. I can't keep a schedule, y'all. Mm -mm. All right, so let's get some angel messages from the angel deck here. Angels, Scorpio, please, and their person. What's going on for Scorpio and their person, please? What messages do you have for Scorpio and this person that Scorpio is thinking about? What messages do you have for Scorpio? Okay, so the first card, let's see, y'all. We have peaceful um, resolution. So it's going to be some conversation eventually with you and this person, um, communicating about something. Again, for some of you, you might have a family together or a business. So you guys do need to keep in communication with each other when it comes to that, maybe co-parenting. But I feel like it's going to be um, some kind of peaceful um, resolution here. Maybe, you know, just, you know, trying to be positive around the kids or for the kids or trying to be positive you know in professional wise um but i see some kind of conversation being held here and understanding and then we have trust this is something that you guys need to work on regardless if you guys are going to be together or not okay the angels are calling for trust here you know calling for you know if you have questions ask questions if you don't believe in it and believe in this person okay if your intuition is kicking in then follow that feeling because something is just not right and a hundred percent of the time you guys when your intuition is telling you something and that feeling and that nagging feeling can't go away you're actually right okay so you have to trust within yourself all right so trust it could be for this person or for yourself to trust in your intuition okay it's up to you scorpio whatever you do desire you know hard work they the universe know your hard work and whatever you put in it if it's your love life um if it's your business it's going to work um in the long run okay you might go through some bumps some crannies some people could handle the bumps some people can't you know all of our all of us scorpios are not the same all right we're not cut from the same tree okay or the same cloth they want to say the same cloth we're all from the same tr tree but not from the same cloth i guess i don't know you guys but um <laughs> all right then we have within the next few months you're gonna have some kind of discovery some kind of change some kind of understanding because i do see like you know, a bright light. I see answers coming towards you. I see the angels, divine angels coming towards you, letting you know, like you're going to be like, it's going to be like a change in your life, Scorpio. It's going to be an accomplishment. It's going to be like, like, okay, trust the process kind of moment, you know? Let's see it here. For Scorpio, please. We have yes, we have not the right time, we have you're ready, we also have look for the signs, okay? So I believe that if you are thinking that you're going to be happy in the long run, the answer is yes here, Scorpio. The angels are letting you know the rainbow is all over you. Your head is just a lot of different colors here. They see happiness, okay? They see a journey. They see accomplishment, okay? I'm feeling like a decision, like something in your mind is like you want to walk away from this, this, this situation or you want to close out a chapter. And we all understand that. But the angels want you to wait for a moment and look for the signs. They're going to give you some signs. They're going to give you some enlightenment. You're going to find out what's going on here and then make the decision understand it all and then come to a conclusion okay they believe that you are ready for this you're ready for a relationship you're ready for whatever they bring you um you just have to believe in yourself that you are ready for some people i feel like 
I'm getting this message like, maybe I'm not ready. That's why it's not coming to me. But no, the angels are saying you are ready for this. All right. All right. So we have no here. We have choose new direction. We have listen to your intuition, you guys. And we have within the next few weeks. Wow. So for some of you, the next few months, then some of you, the next few weeks in the back of the deck, we have in the near future. Oh, wow. Look at this, you know. So Scorpio, I feel like there's going to be judgment here, whatever going on with this no card here. All right. Because I'm seeing the angels surrounding you. I'm seeing the angel giving you this alignment. I'm seeing the angels, you know, stopping you from, you know, making anything worse. I'm not saying that you're making anything worse, Scorpio, but they don't want to get you get you in a deep situation. So I'm seeing a lot of protective energy around you. I'm seeing like you want to choose a new direction. You want to start over. You want a new life. You're so sick of what's going on right here, okay? And they're going to give you this sign. They're going to give you whatever you seek. You just have to be patient, okay? And they want you to actually trust the process. It's about, I'm being back to pull, like, trust the process, Scorpio, okay? Everything will make sense soon, all right? Listen to your intuition, trust in yourself, all right? Whatever you decide to do, they will be behind you. And this is what I'm seeing. The next few weeks, there will be um, things changing. And then in the next few months, it will be like a completion here. Like you will see, oh my God, wow. Like you will see changes in the next few weeks. I'm seeing the angels sit with you. I'm seeing you being counseled. For some of you, when it comes to love, you guys are sitting together being counseled, um, being protected. I'm seeing your family being protected. I'm seeing the angels like working on this to bring you guys back into a better space, okay, with this 11-11 uh, card, all right? But this is what I have for you. Scorpio in your daily read we're going to go ahead and do your bonus in a moment if you guys if it resonates y'all know what to do like this video give this video a big thumbs up here on the channel if it doesn't resonate I'll have a link in the description box it will be your playlist you guys thank you for so much for all your love and support and I'll see you guys soon bye